And he does that in game one at home. Gives up seven runs in four innings with two home runs. Someone else, I saw somebody tweeted, yeah, pay me $43 million to shit my pants. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions. I'm Corbin. I'm not Max Scherzer. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. And Patreon. Subscribe to me. Like, Am button. I right? Patreons. Uh, today we got a trailer, and this is of an old, not old, old, but like a couple years old. As old as your mom? Yeah. Cool. Uh, Netflix series that I'm, yeah. heard you, I'm sure you've heard about. Dahmer? No. Uh, We're watching that. Are you? Yeah. Yeah, that's good. It's really well done. Well, this We're is, on episode four. This is a very different show. Okay. This is Indian Matchmaker. Oh, yeah. You've heard about it, right? Purposefully you, avoided it? it. No. Have you seen it? Purposefully avoided it in case we saw trailers of the show. Uh, so I think this is the, the first season. I think they're on like the second now or something. But it's supposed to be like this. Really like... It's a reality show. Reality Correct. show. Almost like cringe slash toxic or like... I can't wait to see. <laughs> like, I've been wanting to see stuff on I've it. heard about this a lot on like... I. I, it's not my style of show, but yeah, I've just heard so much oh. about it. I don't watch reality shows. We do. Um, so, I'm, I'm, but I'm sure, like, in, uh, since Andrani has a bunch of Indians on her feed, she's probably like has a bunch of oh. friends that have already watched it. Well, so. one of the people that we really listen to a lot because she's almost a hundred percent right is Andrani's sister, my sister-in-law, uh -huh. and she'll tell. That's how we got hooked up to a lot of shows. Dahmer was one of them that she told us to watch, and vice versa. We'll tell her stuff. But this was one that she she told, asked us if we were watching it yet, and said no. And it was not for like the artistic value; it no, was no. for the cringe value. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so this is the 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 trailer. Great for it. I'm excited. Uh, so if you watch a show, let us know. Uh, I, I I don't know if you'll ever get like a watch along of this. This is literally not my style at all. But maybe you can force. I don't know. Yeah. Well, I, let's see what the let's, see, let's yeah, talk let's, about it after the trailer. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> I'm not a reality person. <laughs> like I stay. Like in. there's never been a reality show you like at all. Like I understand some of them. Like I've never liked my my wife, Jersey Shore, The Bachelor. Those don't float my boat. One of my wife's guilty pleasures, and she calls it her trash TV, is the shows back in the day of like the Mormons that have like a bunch of wives, like sister. Oh wives. yeah, S sister wives. <laughs> She's like I like it's so terrible, but I love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the only reality show. So I've watched a couple episodes. I'm like, oh boy. <laughs> we, we almost always will watch like Dancing with the Stars or a documentary series. Mm -hmm. That's that reality kind of thing. Yeah. But when can, we're, yeah, very seldom do we watch a but reality show. But I've heard a show. lot about this show. I know, we, as have we. Let's go. Cheers. It would be like a relaxing 10 days, right? What would you do for 10 days? Why did you put the word relaxing in front of it? Can you relax? Not for me. I will talk to you never. So what? fickle minded and fussy. And I'm here to help them. In India, the marriages, they are between two families. So the parents guide their children. And that is the work of a matchmaker. Very nice person. Understand sense of humor. You know how I hate comedy. What? The clients, they want everything. Someone charming? Equal to my pay or higher. Adjustment is also important. You have to be attracted to the person and the person has to be good. I don't think that it's a lot to ask for. I'm really close to my mom. I wholeheartedly trust her judgment. If he doesn't finalize, me and my husband are going to finalize the girl for him. That is what I've decided. Matchmaking has become a tough job. But I'm trying my best. Here we are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I fill my time so that I don't sit and realize how single I am. You meet a lot of people and then you're like, why is it taking so much of time to meet yeah. the right person? My efforts are meaningless if the stars are not aligned. In the beginning, it was kind of awkward. <laughs> so... Hi. I, <laughs> it's our time now. Wow. I live in North Carolina. You live in Austin. How does that work for you? I want to see you again. Oh, they're in America. I'm a matchmaker. This is a new process for me, but what if things are about to turn around? Giving happiness to others. How many of these are in America? I don't know, man. Because, like, that last shot, 
A lot of them had an American accent, so maybe it's Americans setting up a matchmaker so they could find another Indian. Or it's just NRIs and their families, you know, it, it's still the same principle for them. And I, while I was watching this, I do actually like a series that my wife uh, watches, um, and it's called Love on the Spectrum. Oh, I've heard of it. Oh, you'd love it. Yeah. It's just pe autistic people. Right. Trying to find love. Yeah, I'm sure I will. <laughs> oh, love it's it. the most adorable thing you'll ever watch. I bet it's, it it's is. It's absolutely amazing. I bet it is. Because uh, that's like the non toxic stuff. Right. <laughs> like, yeah. Isn't, they're just, they're just, you're just rooting for them. Right. <laughs> and that's, I don't like, like, I say this a lot, and it's true. We live in a world with an increasing number of what I refer to as doorknobs, human beings with very low intelligence and emotional quotients and no desire to see them improved. Many reality shows are built on that, mm -hmm. highlighting really dumb things mm -hmm. and making people celebrities out of it. Yeah, but people- I totally don't like that. Yeah, but people love trash TV. Uh, some people do love trash TV. Some, like Some people like, like watching, because obviously a lot of reality show, even though it's supposed to be real, is scripted. It's scripted. So like you can, they're like, oh, that's so cringy. Right. It's meant to do that because they know people like watching cringy stuff and exactly. judging people for how, like, I don't like comedy. <laughs> what? <laughs> I, my wife's guilty pleasure when it comes to these kinds of shows. Yeah. All you have to do is add the word housewives and she's in. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. She Beverly like, Hills Housewives. George Kardashian. Oh, somewhere? she oh, loves man. the Kardashians. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I'm surprised she hasn't watched the show yet. I'm so, only because she watched, we watch stuff together. Yeah. And so we don't watch stuff that we know could possibly end up on the channel. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, yeah, this is. Um, yeah, you can watch this. <sighs> I, I, it will, I promise, we'll be frustrated with what we get frustrated with in movies that depict the oh, yeah, matchmaking oh, yeah. situations and when the families have more of a voice than the individuals it and was, I, everything I, else. The only argument I've heard that's good for, for like the arranged marriages, and it's not really good, it's just the most logical one I've heard, is that Indians are so busy, they don't have time to look for love. And so they want somebody, so they, they say their, to their mom, find me somebody, I don't have time. Wait, right, which my, my question Whatever. for that is, if you don't have time to look for it, how do you have time to sustain it? Yeah, uh, obviously, yeah. it's your life, you do what you want but, with your life, obviously. Sure. Yeah. Uh, but that's like the most logical one I've heard right. for it all, but obviously it's a big part of Indian culture, and we know that, and it's, it's been uh, thousands of movies. Well, in this one, the logic of it, I can understand. This is more like speed dating. By a level of... Not empathy, because that means that you can you have been in those shoes. Um, I can sympathize, I guess, when you take into consideration how marriage, whether it's a love marriage or it's an arranged marriage in India, family plays a much, much, much bigger role than in America. It's about the individuals. Families are an important part of it, but they're secondary. Whereas in Indian relationships, it's primary mm -hmm. and the individuals are secondary. Yeah, uh, that's. That's where I understand this whole matchmaking and the parents have the say because of that logic. I don't agree with the logic or understand it. Um, but I, it's intriguing to me because I do know and have heard many people say this. I've gotten messages from stupid babies that say this. Not all arranged marriages end up bad. There's many arranged marriages that turn out with really happy, healthy families and the husband and wife love each other. And, uh, it, yeah. you know, it happens. Yeah, absolutely. It, is there in the show matchmaking done for same-sex couples? I would hope so. But I would hope so, too. Um, I don't know. I can't. Is that a, a specialty? It looks like in the first season there's, what, eight? Eight episodes? Eight episodes or so. Um, I've never heard anybody say, I hate comedy. That's like saying I hate laughter. Uh, yeah, so you guys can let us know... Um, Yeah, I wonder if there's. Uh, you guys can let us know if this is something that you'd be interested in seeing us watch. Uh, yeah, it's or, in the U.S. and India. Okay. Yeah. Uh, or if it's just a total cringe fest and we'll hate it. Yeah. Or, frustrating. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. This is because it's not our normal style of thing. If it has uh, a redeeming quality to it, that's or a maybe big, or maybe big there's plus. or maybe there's no redeeming and you you're literally just watching to. Watching the, the car crash? Yeah, yeah. essentially. 
<laughs> Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Uh, I don't watch a lot of reality television. What's the vote, kids? But I know this is a massive show currently uh, in India. Like, yeah. it's, I just hear people talking about it all the time, for good or bad. But that's what Netflix wants. They want you to talk about it for good or bad. Absolutely. <laughs> because that means you're watching. Yep. Um, and that's what these shows are for. Anyway, so you guys can let us know if you watch a show. Uh, and uh, what else? Uh, uh, maybe some of them that were on it are stupid babies. Let us know. Do you hate comedy? Do you hate us? If she hates comedy, she's not a fan of us. That's for sure. We are the kings of comedy here. The, King. s- the kings of stupidity and the kings of comedy. Let us know, Dimbler.